And we are back from nurturing a love for books and a young child to building a platform that supports writers at every step of their journey. This company is committed to transforming literary dreams into reality. And we've got sharing with us two very special guests. They are the authors and owners of the Son of Tigger Publishing. And guess what? It's Kevin Grimes Sr., Kevin Grimes Jr. And when you look at Junior, Junior is really a junior. <laughs> I know you get that a lot. Yes. 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 So for you, obviously, the opportunity to do this, um, you know, with your son, what's that mean for you? It just means the world. It's, it's part of my purpose of waking up every day, just knowing that I'm not only doing it for myself anymore, I'm doing it for him as well. Right. So highly motivated. Yeah. Junior, I'll say, right? You're an mm -hmm. author yes. and you're a publisher. And how old are you? Eight. So you're eight and an author and a publisher. How do you feel about that? Good. Real good, huh? What's it like working with Dad? Busy. Mm-hmm. How's it been? I mean, obviously, to, to, to really instill this in your son, give your son the opportunity to, to see and also to be a part at an early age. Good. Just, just knowing that, show him that hard work, right? Mm -hmm. As well as everything else that I do, he's a part of. And just another opportunity for him to not only know what I'm doing, but actually be an owner of a company and understand what it is to actually pay bills and have to go into his account. And we have to pay publishers, we have to pay illustrators, we have to pay for marketing. These are all things that he's learning and seeing. So he's, you're watching this too and you're getting to see this happen? Yeah. And you're doing it? I watch the news sometimes. Mm -hmm. And then you watch him do, the, do some work too, huh? Yeah, and I'm always curious about what he's doing. And that curiosity said, "What? Not? I'm not. I'm not just going to tell you. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you and make you a part of it, right? Mm -hmm. The opportunities that I wasn't given, I'm making sure that all those opportunities are given to him. So this collaboration of, you know, son and not just son, but also author and then author also publisher, right? right? You're taking you're taking him into this world, and now when you take him into this world, now you have a literal product that you have out here. Correct. So we have this first project coming out, another one coming out later this year, but also giving others opportunity, right? Mm -hmm. uh, we'll get more into that, but just the opportunity to now us being owners and having control, we can now give other people the opportunity and teach them how to do it as well. So for yourself, what was the turning point to say, listen, I just don't want to just talk to him about it. I want to show this to him. What was the turning point for you to say, listen, I want to do this? And just keep trying and trying and just the frustration of how hard it was to do it for myself, mm -hmm. right? Just trying to put out a book as an author and the struggles and the hurdles, I'm like, wow you know what, I want to take the control on myself to now I can not only have, be able to do whatever I want in the future, but then teach others how to do it as well. The struggle's real. It's very real. So what, are, real. what are the struggles? I mean, somebody says, listen, everybody thinks well, I can just put out a book, but then you find out reality, there's a whole lot behind that thing. So it's just like, <laughs> every, it's just like everything else in this world, right? If you want to learn something that you don't know, you got to pay for it, mm -hmm. right? Everyone, they got to teach you how to find the right um, editor, teach you how to... They gotta, you got to pay to learn the right illustrator. Finding an illustrator took over a year. Finding the right person who can really capture what I was looking for and embody it into a book took over a year. Yeah. A lot of work. A lot of work. Junior, talk to me about this. How do you feel now that you have a, a, a book out? Put your hand up. Um, amazing. Yeah. yeah? And my dad is coming off with another book. So he's, he's dropping he's dropping dimes on you here. There's another book in the making too, huh? Yeah. He okay. wants to he wants to become he wants to be on the red carpet someday. <laughs> that was right. Listen, yeah. you want to be on the red carpet with him because if y'all partners, he doesn't just make it to the red carpet. You got to be on the red carpet too. You want to be there with me? Who will go first? Yeah, <laughs> you go first. You go first. You go first. What? <laughs> you been working battle, hard the more. The battle for the red carpet begins. Exactly. But you got but. Honestly, you do have something else coming out. You got a coloring book. Yeah, we got a coloring book coming out later this year. So, so for you, people who watch get the coloring book in this book, let's walk through first this book and tell people what they can expect. Um, just expect a loving story of a father and son, just a day out with us, a, a day of us from the time we wake up to our daily routines to the time he goes to school to the time we come home and do his homework, and just a full day. Yeah. Just a full day, exciting day. 
And to see your work actually, you know, it's a concept in the beginning. You, you think about it, you're having meetings, you're talking about people, you're interviewing people, right? It took you a year to get the illustrator. To finally get to that place where it comes across and you can see it for yourself, what's that mean? Not just for me, for him to see it, mm -hmm. to know this is what actually, and this one was, was I'm gonna say it was easy, right? Because it's what we actually do, what we actually say. So it was easy for us to put it together, but just to see it physically was just, whew. It felt, it felt almost as good as the day he was born. Wow. Um, Cause it's like you birthed something that you worked hard and you put a lot of commitment and time and energy and cries and tears to see it, it was just amazing. Yeah. And what do you think this does for other father-son relationships to see, hey, I got your son along, you know, it used to be take your son to work day. Yeah. And now it's like, really, you're taking your son to work every day. Every day. Um, I hope, I, I want to motivate everyone, right? Mm -hmm. it's, especially if I'm able to motivate fathers to understand that you know, you always see the mothers in the forefront, which we give all credit to and we appreciate, but there's also fathers that can be at the forefront just as much pushing the, the narrative and pushing the button to say, hey, we could do this and we can take it to another level. Yeah. So if people want to get the book, how do they go about doing that? They can go to www.sonatigapublishing.com. Mm -hmm. Are you excited about the future here? You got some books out and now you got go back to school, but still, you excited to be an author and a publisher? Yes. All right. Well, I want you to have a great school year, too, by the way, okay? I know you got to do some work besides this, so when school hits, best wishes. Even my dad needs some work, too. <laughs> give, I'm, give, I'm, I'm going to give him some work. I'm going I'm, to I'm, I'm make him come back and see me and talk more about the work, so that's good. All right? All right. Well, Kevin Grimes, Jr., Appreciate pleasure it. to meet you, sir. Thank you. Eight years old, handling business. Appreciate Senior. it. you. Thank you so much for being Thank with you. us. All right, listen, now, if you want more information, I want you to do me a favor. Visit the website, sonofticketpublishing.com. You can find out more about it there. We encourage you, don't go anywhere. We got more open coming up right after this.